Spanning 11 miles of shoreline along the Patapsco River, the new plans will create completely new connections between the 19 neighborhoods of South Baltimore, which have historically been disconnected all to the waterfront. It's a goal the city has had since 1904. Now, plan reimagine Middle Branch is set to take shape, starting with new parks and trails. It's wrapping all the way around from Brooklyn and Curtis Bay through Cherry Hill and Westport, all the way around to Port Covington. Those behind the effort envision a new recreation campus, fishing docks and gathering places. And in the heart of Middle Branch Park, they want to transform the boathouse into a market space. With plans to build a boathouse for the Baltimore Rowing Club, planners say they want people directly impacted by the work to be in the driver's seat. Speak up now while we have the opportunity. Residents like Keisha Allen. She spoke up about the lack of access to the area from her Westport neighborhood. That's why new connections will be constructed. This project will mean nothing if, if Westport can't get here. If our kids can't cross two sets of train tracks, and get here, but other people can come from the surrounding counties or other parts of the city or even other parts of South Baltimore. It means nothing. Work is already underway to take Middle Branch from Baltimore's forgotten waterfront to the city's next great attraction. In the next five years, you're going to see about $100 million worth of improvements to the neighborhoods of South Baltimore. In South Baltimore, Tommy Clark, WBAL-TV 11 News.